Hey, Jazz, good morning. Good morning, Keon. Good to see you today as well. Welcome in, my friends. We'll give you a few more minutes here since we've got a little bit of a light crowd yet. Good morning, Sammy. Good to see you back today. All right, y'all. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, surely we got a new picture. Very nice. All right, y'all, good morning. I'm sorry, I was reading some, a text from Dr. Dave. All right, I'm gonna send one more reminder out and then we will jump in. Um, you can head to Summit if you haven't already. Um, I want to use today to get a lot of people caught up um, because as I was putting in grades for progress reports um, last night, there's a bunch of us who are um, I'm behind on some stuff. So I want to give you guys uh, another opportunity to make it up so we don't fall behind as we keep moving through our project here. 
So let me just send this last reminder out. Should be good to go. All right. So if you get that Google Hangout or get that email from me. You can disregard it since you are already here. Great job. Um, and again, if you haven't already, please head to Summit. Uh, what we're going to do today, I'm going to do a quick refresher on everything that is due that you need to have to be all caught up. And then most of the time, I'm going to give to you guys to um, get going on it. Because again, if you, you know, and I'm sure you saw this if you checked Summit between last night and today, um, a lot of us behind on some stuff. So let me get my screen shared here. All right. Hey, good morning, Bev. Welcome. All right. Also, if you are not already, please get to Summit, find our class, Contemporary Issues, and then. Students and the First Amendment is our project, all right? Now, the biggest thing that people were, excuse me, biggest thing that people were behind on when I was putting in grades last night is the actual checkpoint for checkpoint one, okay? Which looks like this. It says checkpoint product. And then if you scroll down here, you're answering this question. What is the difference between the Tinker Standard and Fraser Standard as, as it relates to students' free speech, okay? So all you're doing for this checkpoint is typing in your response. Give me like one paragraph, three to five sentences, answering this question, you know? So we talked about, we looked at both these two Supreme Court cases, Tinker, which is the one with the girl who wore the armband to protest the Vietnam War, Fraser, which is the one where the guy gave the, the speech with some kind of inappropriate double meanings, all right. And they were both suspended, both went to the Supreme Court. One said, yes, you're protected by the First Amendment. The other one didn't. What this question is just asking you is, what's the difference between those two cases as it relates to how we give, you know, free speech rights to high school students today? Okay. So that's what you're filling out for, for the actual checkpoint. Now, some of you may have finished um, like the source set, which looks like this. Okay, some of you may have finished this and some of you may have finished um, the checkpoint task, which looks like this. This was what was due after the source set, okay? If you finish both of these, doing the actual checkpoint will be very easy. As a matter of fact, I would recommend if you haven't finished those to do those first before you do the actual checkpoint because everything you do in these um, will help you finish uh, the checkpoint over here, okay? If you did the checkpoint, but maybe you haven't finished one of these, then I would go back and get them both finished because um, even though you might be green on the checkpoint, if you, don't, if you haven't finished all three, then I might still mark you as needs improvement because all three have been due, okay? So that step one is make sure all the stuff for checkpoint one is finished. The checkpoint product itself, the source set, which most of us should have done by now, since that was the first thing. And then the um, checkpoint task, which looks like this, where we're taking stuff from the source set and just kind of breaking it down a little bit more specifically. All right. Questions on anything so far? If you are on board and with me on the same page, give me a thumbs up or a yes in the chat so that I know.
All right, Shirley says yes, thank you. Everybody else, Sammy, Jazz, Hian, you guys are all still with me? Yes. If I don't see anything in the chat, I'm gonna assume that means yes. Okay. So if at any point you are no, oh, okay. All right, Jazz, thank you for responding. So just to back up real quick and slow it down, all right. All I'm doing is going over everything that we should have do. Um, because as I was putting in grades for the progress report last night, there were a lot of people that were behind on a lot of things. The biggest thing was checkpoint one, the actual checkpoint, okay, which looks like this, right, where you're kind of answering this question down here at the bottom. What's the difference between the Tinker standard and Fraser standard, right, as it relates to students' free speech? So what's the difference between these those two cases and how they affect the way we think about students' free speech rights today, right? Now, so uh, now if you already have this finished, but you didn't do one of these two things, the source set, which looks like this, right? Or you didn't do the checkpoint task, which looks like this, then we wanna make sure that those are done as well. and. All three of these are found in Summit under checkpoint one. So the checkpoint is up here, and then the source set and the checkpoint task will be further below when you scroll down, okay? Are you with me now, Jazz? Or anybody else who was still a little bit lost? Hopefully that helped. I'm going to keep on going since I didn't hear anything, but if you're still lost or any questions, don't be afraid to give me a shout or put it in the chat and stop me. All right. So now your next question is obviously, okay, I finished all three of those things. Am I caught up? The answer is maybe <laughs> because if you remember, we started talking about no prior restraint last week, which is when um, we're stopping something from being published before it actually comes out, right? And that's infringing on our First Amendment rights. Good morning, Darian, welcome, right? So if you are all finished with everything for checkpoint one that I just showed you, then what you should be doing is under checkpoint two, scroll down and looking at this source set, okay? which works the same way um, as the other one, okay? Now, I know these two sources are pretty long. It's a lot of reading, and I know that might be what is um, tripping people up, okay? So if we can have source A and B done, then I'm gonna count this as green, okay? If you want some extra credit, you can do all three, okay? But I know these ones are a little bit longer, a little bit more in depth to read than the last one. Um, and, I, and I don't want people to fall behind because of that. So that's what we're gonna do for this one. So source A and B should be done for it to be green. And then if you wanna do source C uh, on this one, that'll be just like kind of an extra credit thing, all right? And so then this is what you should be working on if you are all caught up on the checkpoint one stuff. All right. If you finish this, then let me know and we'll chat privately about what to do next. Okay. But one more time, quick recap, because I saw 
I do see we have some uh, people joining us. Welcome uh, to you, Darian Sabrine. Good to see you on today. Okay. And who else do I got to get saying? I have to. All right. So just to recap, uh, everything that is due. And those of, those of you who joined late, that's just what we're doing today. It's just kind of like a catch-up day because um, I put in grades for the progress report last night. And there's still a lot of us that are behind. Um, so I don't want to keep moving forward until we can get um, somewhat more caught up. So what is everything that we should have done to be caught up? Again, you're on summit under our class, contemporary issues, okay? And then you should have checkpoint one right here. And again, biggest thing that people were behind on was the actual checkpoint. So compare types of free speech. Um, and then looks like this. Ooh, nope, not that one. This one, right? It says checkpoint product. That's how you can tell the difference. And then all you're doing is just answering this question in one paragraph, three to five sentences in this box right here, okay? Now, to do this checkpoint, you should have this source set, right? Which most people should have done because that's like the first thing we did. And then this checkpoint task, right? You should have those two things done before you tackle the checkpoint because it will be much, much easier because that's where you're gonna get all the information you need to help answer this question, okay? Now, if you kind of work backward and you have the checkpoint finished, but you don't have one of these two things done, then I would go back and finish them because all three of them were due. So all three of them should be done for you to be green and caught up, all right? If you get all three of those things finished and you're all good with the checkpoint one stuff, then you can go down here to checkpoint two, no prior restraint, scroll down until you see no prior restraint source set, which looks like this, all right? And then you just do this the same way we did the previous source set, where you are highlighting words you don't know, underlining the key facts, answering this question over here. And what I was just telling people is because this source set is a little bit more, you know, of a lengthy read in a lot of them, we you can just do source A and B. So if you have those two done, I will count it as green. If you do source C, that'll be kind of like an extra credit thing, okay? So that's gonna be the deal for this one, all right? And that is uh, everything that went on to progress board. So if you get all that done, then you are all the way caught up, okay? Questions on any of that stuff, on anything we have to do? And again, remember, if I don't see a question in the chat or hear one, I'm going to assume you don't have any. So if you are a little lost, you know, these are the times to speak up or type up. All right, Shirley says no. Awesome. All right, well then, ladies and gents, the rest of today, which is about um, 30, 35 minutes, um, I'm going to give to you to just get caught up on whatever you are behind on, okay? I will be in the chat muted. If you are struggling, let me know, and we can do a breakout room real quick, and I can try to get it, kind of get you caught up, maybe a little bit better one-on-one, -on -one. all right? If you don't need any help. It's just a matter of like, I just need to get the work, I just need to get the work done. Um, then today is a good day to do that. Okay. To answer your question, Sammy, the checkpoint one stuff is already, that's already been due. Um, that's why I mark people read. I, the source set is what was due for this last progress report. So that would have been on Friday. Okay. And then we have class again, this coming Friday, where I will introduce the next thing we're doing. So the short answer to that question is to be all the way caught up, you should have all this done 
by the beginning of next class, which is Friday. Okay. But now you have the rest of class today and Wednesday and Thursday. Now, I obviously know we might have a work schedule and other classes, um, but that should be more than enough time to get caught up if you're managing your time effectively. Okay. So if you have all the checkpoint one stuff done, which includes the checkpoint itself, the source set and the checkpoint task, then yes, the only other thing you need to do is the source set for checkpoint two. And if you finish that, let me know and we'll do a quick private breakout room and I'll explain what the next thing is uh, you can work on. All right. Did that answer all your questions, Sammy? Cool. All right. And Kalia, thank you for joining us just now. I see you. Welcome. All right. And so again, Kalia, real quick, I'll just do one more quick screen share recap. All right. And then we can get working. But we are just basically trying to get caught up on stuff today since a lot of us were behind when I was putting in uh, progress report grades. So we're working from Summit. To be all the way caught up, we need these things under checkpoint one right here. We need the actual checkpoint that looks like this, where you are just answering this question about the two core cases down here in this box. Okay. But before you do this, you should have the source set. It looks like this. You should have this done, which I think you do. Right? And then you should have the checkpoint task done. That looks like this, right? Because both of these will give you the info you need to help you answer this question, right? They can all be found under checkpoint one in Summit. Here's the checkpoint itself. And then down below, if you scroll down, you'll find the source set compared to free speech source set. And then compared to as a free speech checkpoint task, all right? If you get all three of those finished, then you are going down here to the next checkpoint, no prior restraint, right? And scrolling down until you see the source set for that one and filling it out the same way. But for this one, you only have to have sources A and B done to be green. If you do source C, that'll be like extra credit, okay? So just one last quick wrap up. Right. So questions with anything, put it in the chat or give me a shout. And um, yeah, Sammy, you and I can uh, um, can jump in a breakout room after everybody gets started and we can kind of break that down, all right? So, Again, the rest of today is going to be geared towards people getting caught up. I'm going to be in the chat, muted. If at any time you have a question, just put it in the chat or give me a shout. All right. But please uh, use this time effectively so that um, I can see a lot of my reds change to yellows and greens um, the next time I go to put grades in. All right. Thank you very much. And Sammy, give me a minute or two and then... Um, we will chat about uh, source B in the source set. All right. Thank you. Hey, Derek, thank you for joining us, my friend. Uh, 
we are doing a kind of a catch up day today. Um, so there you are. I'm trying to look for you on my list. So anything that you know you still don't have done um, that has been due on Summit, today is a day to kind of get caught up on that. All right. And I will put everything that that includes in the chat right now for everybody. So that is all on Summit, everything you need to have caught up. Questions with anything, let me know, all right? And uh, Sammy, like I said, give me another minute. Let me finish my attendance and stuff up, and then we can chat about uh, your questions for the source set for Checkpoint 2. All right, Sammy, I want to go ahead and open uh, a breakout room and we can chat about your questions for the source set for checkpoint two. Uh, is there anybody else who is caught up with checkpoint one and would like help with the source set for checkpoint two? If so, please let me know right now in the chat. Speak now or forever hold your peace. If not, that's totally okay. Um, keep on doing what you're doing, getting caught up with the other stuff. But uh, 
I want to give the opportunity to everybody to jump in that breakout room. Again, anybody else who is caught up on checkpoint one and would like some help on checkpoint two source set for no prior restraint, now is the time to let me know. All right, no worries. Then if not, I'm gonna assume that means we're all still working on stuff for checkpoint one. So that is what we should be working on right now, okay? So, ladies and gents, I'm going to check back in at around um, around 11.15 uh, and kind of see where we are then, all right? All right? Keep up the good work. You should know what you need to work on, all right? Let's make sure we have uh, all this done by next class, which is Friday. So Sammy, that's gonna pop up. Just go ahead, and join that room and we will chat about that source set real quick. All right, I'm gonna pop in this breakout room. Questions, please hold them until I come back and then you can throw them in the chat, all right? Or you can also Google Hangouts message me too if it is super important. I should be able to see that. All right, thank you.
right hello my friends we are back with that just about right on time too okay so hopefully everybody has used this time effectively to um, work on some stuff all right let's do a quick uh poll the chat right now and if you can uh please give me a one to five uh put it in the chat of kind of where your progress is with everything five being i am working on the source set for checkpoint two i'm done with all the stuff for checkpoint one um so i'm good to go all right and then one would be like um i haven't really even started anything i'm still way behind um i need a bunch of help maybe three is like i've done the source set and the checkpoint task for checkpoint one um, but i got to finish the actual checkpoint or like I did the checkpoint, but I got to go back and do the, the source set or the checkpoint task, right? But I'm still working on the checkpoint one stuff, okay? So put that one to five for me in the chat right now. Where are you with your progress with everything? Let me know. And this will help me get a gauge on kind of where everybody's at. Right, thank you, Kalia. All right, again, I'd like to see these come in from everybody as you're working here um, before we wrap up. But we've got about 10 minutes left. So again, try and put your one to five in the chat right now quick, take a brief pause from what you're doing. And then once you throw that in, get back to it. Um, and then I will check back in in about um, six, seven minutes, see where everybody's at, okay? But again, one to five in the chat, what's your progress with this? Five, you know, I'm just about done with the source set for checkpoint two. Uh, I'm all caught up on checkpoint one, I'm good to go. One being like, I still haven't really done the checkpoint one stuff. I'm totally lost, I need a lot of help. Let me know that in the chat so I can get a a feel for how everybody's doing. All right, thank you guys. I will check back in here in a few.
All right, ladies and gents, we got about three minutes left. So again, remember that we should have this stuff caught up on by next class, which is Friday. Um, I will be in the Summit Lab this afternoon from one to three. Um, the link for that, I just put in the chat. So if you are struggling with anything or you have questions and you need to get caught up, um, that is a great place to do it. Please don't hesitate not to jump in. And uh, remember that if you are all caught up, it means you have completed all three of the, the activities for checkpoint one, which include the actual checkpoint itself, the source set and the checkpoint task. And you've also completed this source set for checkpoint two. Right? And then in that source set, we only have to do sources A and B. You don't have to do source C, okay? All right? Can you please, before you leave, um, give me a thumbs up or a yes in the chat that you understand um, everything that you need to be, uh, that you need to have done to be caught up, all right? I wanna see one of those come in from everybody before we go so that I know you are all good. Kali gave me a thumbs up, thank you. I like to see one from everybody else before we leave so that I know there are no questions with anything because um, I don't wanna be putting a lot of reds in. Next time I wanna be putting a lot of greens in. So I wanna make sure you guys know. Uh, Kali, I just saw your question. Yeah, that is no problem. We only have about a minute left, but if you come to that, uh, Afternoon Summit Lab, the link I just put in the chat um, from one to three, that's the, the best place to, to get help with that stuff. So I'd be more than happy to help you then. And if you can't make it today, that's okay. We can do it next class or you can just shoot me an email. I can try to help you that way as well, right? But let me please see a thumbs up or a yes from everybody else in the chat before you go. Thumbs up, yes. I understand everything I need to get done to be caught up. All right, and Sammy, I just got yours. Thank you. Shirley, thank you. Good job. All right, Keon, Darian, Sabrine, Jazz, let me know. All right, once you put that in the chat, you are good to go for today. All right, thank you, Jazz. Good job. All right, so everybody else that's left, Keon, Darian, Sabrine, Bev, Derek, uh, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down in the chat, you know, if you understand everything that you need to do to get caught up. All right, I'm gonna keep the chat open for about another minute. If you are stumped with anything, please reach out or come to the afternoon lab and I will help you out in there as best I can. All right, Derek, thank you. Good job. You are good to go. Cool, Darian. Thank you. Good job, brother. All right, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and end the chat. If you have anything, just reach out to me. Shoot me an email. Come to the Summit Lab, whatever you need. I'll see you all on Friday. Good job.